Build Restoration Service for World Peace by Jesus Christ. The work of salvation. This is the work of believing. When you hear about salvation, know that believing is needed there. Salvation works together with belief. When you believe, you receive salvation. And when you are saved, now you become a believer. And when you are a believer, you are saved. You are now a child of God. Jesus called us to a holy life. The work of salvation is the work of calling us to, work to the holy life. When you don't have Jesus, you are not living in the holy life. Your things are not well. This is the work of the grace. The work of salvation is the work of the grace. This is the work of the grace. We don't pay for us to receive salvation. I'm calling all of you who are not yet born again to stand up and come and stand here on the altar. You know yourself. I've told you that you mustn't deceive yourself. Tell yourself the truth that you need Jesus. You stand up and come and receive Jesus. And Jesus Christ will be your Savior and your Lord. Close your eyes. It's your time to be saved. Follow me in this short prayer. Say, Lord Jesus, guys, today I'm receiving you as my Lord and my Savior. Come into my heart and give me your life. I believe. Jesus Christ, that you are the Son of God and you died for my sins. But today, I'm receiving your life. This is the life from you. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Pastor Faith, you are coming for counseling and welcoming them. After you are born again, I want to see you growing in the faith and receiving all your blessings which were scattered outside. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Ah, Jesus. You are 
where you, where you are, it's in the presence of God. You have given your life to Jesus Christ. You surrendered yourselves and said, I want this Jesus Christ. Now when we are in Jesus Christ, the Bible says you are a new creature. All things has passed away. All what you have been doing, even yesterday, even before you came here, they've just remained in the past. You are a new creature now. You are the child of God. So today, I feel excited to see you surrendering and say things of the past. I no longer want them. Now I want Jesus Christ. I want to follow him. Jesus Christ is your savior and your redeemer. Have a lifestyle of prayer. Spend your time in the word of God. Read your Bible daily. In the morning. Whether during the day. At night. Read your Bibles. And I'll encourage you to have a Bible in your own language. A language that you will understand better. And it's nice to have your own Bible. Because when you want to highlight or underline, that would be your Bible. And we'll encourage you to read from the Gospel of John. John has 21 chapters. So by the day 21, you'll be used now to reading your Bible. So the Gospel of John will be guiding you how to read the Bible. From there you can go to the other Gospel. And when you are reading your Bible, you must read it prayerfully. Ask the Holy Spirit to teach you and to reveal to you what is it that you are reading about? Amen. You need to fellowship with other Christians. So you have to have a place where you can worship the Lord Jesus Christ. You have to go and look for a church where they preach is Jesus Christ. It does not mean that when you sing a building and then it's saying church, what, what, that is the true church. Because you don't know what is inside there. Seek the church where they preach Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ alone. No Jesus Christ plus. If you are around this area, we are fellowshipping in this place. This is the center of WRS. Lena is center at WRS under the leadership of Pastor Faith. And Pastor Sibanyoni, our service we start intercession at half past nine. Half past nine. The service starts at ten. We have prayers on Tuesdays. We have youth a gathering. It's like a Bible school for youth. On Saturdays. So we'll need to know where you are staying. So that we can even come and visit you at your home. I want you to give your names, your surnames, and your home address to the ashes. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes, even your cell phone numbers. Amen. Hallelujah. You'll go with the ashes. You'll give them your names, all your details. Lamb of God, you are seated at the right hand of the Father, you are holy, holy, you are holy. World
restoration service for world peace by Jesus Christ.